Okay, hi. Um, from time to time, I'm going to be picking, uh, recommending some DVD movies to you. And, uh, you know, I think it's just a good idea. You know, some movies will be obscure. Some movies you've heard of already and may never thought to see. And other times, uh, you'll just take a look at them and, uh, you know, do what you want. If you want to watch them, you watch them. If you don't, you don't. First movie I want to recommend, and it's a weird choice to pick the first DVD pick, but um, I really enjoyed the movie. You know, it's very obscure. You know, not many people have heard of it came out in 88, I was about 8 or 9, uh, and then I hadn't seen it in a long time, and then I, you know, I started a video store, so I picked it up on VHS as the video store was closing, and I really enjoyed it. Now, it's not, it doesn't have the best special effects, it's not the best acting, but it does tell a really good story, and, uh, you know, there's a lot of good scenes, and the movie's called Miracle Mile. Miracle Mile uh, stars Anthony Edwards from ER, as well as Marie Winningham, who uh, you know, most people probably know her, I guess, from St. Elmo's Fire. And uh, she's also did a couple of episodes of Grey's Anatomy. It's a very good movie. And um, it's, it's basically about the, you know, the, this guy who meets this woman at the museum and they make plans to go out that night. Uh, but he oversleeps because the power goes out. And when the power comes back on, it's about 2 in the morning. And so he, he goes down to the diner where he was supposed to meet her, and she's not there. And he goes to call her on a payphone, and the payphone starts ringing, and he picks up. You know, on the other line is some nervous guy who's talking about, you know, we did it, we did it. To make a long story short, basically what they did is they wound up setting off a, uh, a nuclear bomb that's supposed to go off in L.A. And the rest of this movie is this um, frantic ticking clock scenario of trying to get to a helicopter to go off to safety. And, you know, it's, it's basically like a complete Armageddon's story that, you know, it starts off very tame and calm, but all of a sudden there's a, a sudden panic in L.A. And, um, you know, it's, it's pretty interesting to see. And, you know, once again, it, it doesn't have the best acting, it doesn't even have the best writing, but it is an enjoyable story. And parts of it that make it great is, one, the, the score is done by Tangerine Dream, and... It's a very good score, and it really does carry the story along. You know, the only other score that I know they've done, to my mind, was uh, the score to 3 O'Clock High with Casey Samasco. And, um, you know, once again, done very well. Uh, the movie's directed by named Steve DeJarnat, and, um, you know, all he's really done is a whole bunch of TV shows. You know, like he, he, he directed um, e episodes of ER. You know, so he's really not known for movie making. And, and either way, it doesn't matter. It is an enjoyable movie, and... You know, if you have time, you know, rent it. It doesn't cost you anything. Or if you see it at a video store, you know, on, you know, the video store is closed and buy it. It's it's a good two three dollar movie, and and you know, I, I paid nine ninety nine for this movie, and I enjoy it. It's you know, it's it's a lot of excitement, and it's a lot of wow. This you know, what if this did happen? So uh, check it out. The movie's Miracle Mile. Uh, Anthony Edwards, Marie Winningham, and uh, yeah, check it out. Thank you.